everyone. This morning I get the opportunity to go plowing, make a couple extra dollars today. It's uh of course the weatherman blew the storm all out of proportion. We were supposed to get like seven to twelve inches, and I think we got about six maybe at so that's about the most I guess. But it's all nice light and fluffy stuff. I guess I thought it was gonna be super heavy because it started off raining and then it just got cold enough and did a good job of keeping it from uh, getting wet and heavy, I guess. So it's going to be a long day today, and uh, this is Sunday morning, so you'll see this on Monday. So I am skipping over my two parking lots I do the first thing in the morning and jumping right into residentials because them two parking lots, the businesses are closed today, so I will not get to them until uh, later on uh, late this morning or early in the afternoon. So. Anyhow, let's get going. So this morning is going along pretty good, just like it did the last time I was snowing, or snowing, plowing snow. Jeez, here we go again. Rain's still shot. But uh, I just opened up the dentist office, and that way, because when the traffic gets real busy here, I don't have to worry about it, back it out in the traffic, so that's all cleared out. So I'll just go in there and plow out the parking lot when I come back into it, because I'm heading out of town right now uh, to get uh, all them uh, driveways along the shoreline, the lake shoreline there, and, uh, and then work my way back through. And it's not supposed to be snowing right now, but it is. So and the weatherman was sort of close. Actually, it was right on. It snowed today. That's about it. <laughs> So, um, that back drag edge is working well again. Wings are still working well. And that Toro power, whatever the heck that thing's called there, a little single stage uh, blower is working really well too. That's saving me a pile of time for shoveling. And it's easy to get in and out of the truck, like I said before. And I'm still really liking everything, my whole setup for uh, this year. So it's working well, for now. Struggling a little bit with these uh, paved driveways uh, because of what happened with this system that we're in right now is it started off rain, turned to snow, which uh, we had an inch of snow on the ground yesterday, then it started turning to rain again, and then it turned back into snow. So it's uh, there's a crust of about an inch or a half inch or something like that. So the plow is jumping up on it a little bit as I'm going. Uh, quicker than uh, normal in these other driveways and it's taking me I gotta go a couple passes but if I slow right down it'll scrape it right down but I'll just go over it faster so the Sun's coming out I have one more driveway to do in my area and I don't know how long the or in the area I'm at now I don't know how long the Sun's gonna stay out but I'd like to get the dentist office done plow it out uh, so the Sun can melt some of the um, ice and stuff off of there so I can just salt it later on so I don't know we'll see what heck goes on today now
don't know how much of that showed up on camera, but yeah, I got the plow fraying among up. Of course, I ain't got no hitch in the back of my, uh, or I don't have the ball hitch in there, and yeah, couldn't nothing to hook on to, so there I was stuck. But eh, that happens. It's not bad. Only one time so far this year. Because usually I get stuck all the time. I guess I don't, it doesn't matter what I'm in, I'm always getting stuck, but it's always that one last pass. It gets me every single time, whether I'm cut grass, near the ditch line, or plowing stone. Every single time it gets me, but oh well, that's life. The parking lot done and the sun's trying to stay out from behind the clouds but what's going on is we're getting some lake effect snow so it's kind of shading out the sun but hopefully that lets up or the wind changes directions and we can get this all cleared up with sunshine and now we'll use a half amount of salt so we'll see how it's going to go it's only 16 degrees that's the other problem but i think it's in two days or three days it's going to be 45 degrees and rain so yeah, we got a bunch of snow, but eh, by the end of the week or weekend, it should be gone again, and then the next batch coming through. Well, things are going along pretty good so far again, still today. Something like that, I don't know. That didn't come out right. Anyhow, I have one parking lot and two driveways to do, and then I'm done for the day, which should be really good. It'll be about dark, but I'll be done. Uh, actually, no, I won't. i got to go to the dentist office and salt that. almost forgot about that one. Anyhow, just got done talking to a customer and I haven't seen uh, or talked to it in three months, I guess, since it was nice and warm out. So it was kind of nice visiting with some people that you don't get to see all the time. And, and, um, this will probably be the last video you see this in because it's driving me nuts. So part of it's coming off anyhow. Well, it's getting dark on me fast. And I've got uh, one driveway and one parking lot left and that's it. So. It'll be just about dark, or it'll be completely dark by the time I'm done with that parking lot, but that's okay, at least I'll be done. I'll have uh, 12 hours in the plowing today, so yeah, still five hours less than it would have been, because normally with this amount of snow, it would take me 17 hours. So uh, my setup's doing really well this year with the wings, with the putting the wings on our cup, just like uh, so many people made a suggestion for me to do. And that's the way I did it. That worked out really well. And then uh, the back drag edge or blade or whatever you want to call it on the back of that plow has really made a huge difference in back blading or back dragging these uh, driveways. Can't believe how much of a difference that made just that. So, anyhow, that's going to be it for me for today. And hopefully, the next video you see me in, maybe I'll be in my shop working on that. Uh, gravely because I've noticed yesterday when I was out cleaning that up there the proteros kicked to one side so I'm gonna have to do a repair on that so which is not a big repair it's just a small one so uh, thanks for watching and subscribing if you check out the links in the description box below we greatly appreciate it. everybody have a good evening and we will see you on the next one